here is the review of Transformers Movie 2007 Concept Camaro Bumblebee. And this is for you and if you know who you are, here it is. And the same for all of you other people out there watching this video. So as you can see, Bumblebee here is a a concept Camaro 2008 car. And of course, this is from the 2007 Transformers movie. Has the nice Camaro logo painted here. Oh, and if I zoom in here, you can see that it it has the painted Camaro logo right right there. on b both sides. And has some nice painted black stripes. Well, as you can see, on on mine, some of it is a little chip, chip, chipped off. And he rolls really well. Well, th this wheel here Sometimes it works, sometimes it d doesn't. And on the back, he has some painted in tail lights and painted silver exhaust here. And But, but there's no, like, li license on the back here. Because, as you can see, it's, it's just all plain yellow. And he does have a, a gas cap here, which is not pa painted in. And I will have to mention, mine is incomplete. The only thing I'm missing from this figure is... He, he would have a gun here, which also turns into a sword. And you would fit it in here from these two holes and the pegs from the gun. I, I I do have it, but it's somewhere that I have to look for. And, 
and that that's about it for the feel commode. So now to transform him, you want to take the doors, untap them, and fold them out. And you can see these holes is where these pegs go into. Then you want to take the back, bring it down, then separate the back. Take these, bring these up. And here is some cool automorph. When you take the foot and bring it down, the halves of the back here folds up and the windshield here, which is the back windshield, folds down. And when you're going back into vehicle mode, these things just spring back up. Then you just strain his feet, then take the heel piece and fold it down. Then you want to take the roof here and separate it. And now you want to take the front wheels here and the doors and pull them out, which will free up these here so you can get, get these out of the way. Just make sure that these are out of the way. Then you want to take these, rotate them up, so you can bring his arms out more. Take the front windshield, fold it down, which will pop up this piece. Then you want to take the front of the vehicle and and you want to bring it down. And as you do that, his arms and these things will rotate. And you only want to bring this down to about here. So that way you have room to take these here and push them up. And now you can bring this all the way down. And you also want to take this piece, fold it up, and you also want to take these here and bring them up, and for his elbows, you want to rotate them and rotate these up. Do the same on the other side. And 
and you're done. Now, y'all may have noticed that on his chest here, I did put an Autobot Repro Label sticker on him because the, the painted Autobot symbol that he has behind this Autobot symbol was about to light. Well, it, it's already, like, been ch ch chipped off. So I had to put a, a, a sticker, a, an Autobot Repro Label sticker on him. Because the painted one was already ch chipping off. And the, the the robot mode does look really cool, cool, but it did had some issues. But I have fixed some of these, and that is the torso here, which is on a ball joint, has become loose on some people's copies but I have fixed it so now it's more t t tighter and, and it doesn't hang really loose I, I shouldn't say, like, r really t tight. It, it's like, really snug. And these shoulder pieces have also popped off on some people's but I have glued these on, so now these stay on a lot better. And uh, another issue that I have with it is, is these things just ha hang around on the bottom of his elk elbows and for our articulation Head is on a it it is on a ball joint. It it just sometimes comes off on mine. And he does have a a hinge joint on the bottom 
of the ball joint. So he can look up and down. Ball joint at the shoulders, elbow, a bicep swivel, and his hands are on ball joints. And of course, he has a ball joint at the torso here. Oh, and he does have the license plate here. And he, he also does have some metallic blue on him. Ball joint at the legs, knee, and his feet can move up and down. And well, they, they can move up and down on this screw joint here. Not, not this joint, because that's due to the tr transformation. And his toes can move up and down. And, and that's it. And if he had his gun, his gun sword thing, you would clip it onto either one of his hands. So, final thoughts. But both his vehicle mode and his robot mode does look great, but his robot mode does have some issues like which I have fixed like the 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 to lower torso here being loose and the shoulder pieces pop popping off and also these things just hang just hang around on the bottom of his elbows. So, I think that's about it. So, there you have it. Transformers Movie 2007 Concept Camaro Bumblebee the, the 2008 Concept Camaro Bumblebee And if you like this video, give me a like, comment, and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.